A local organization is helping firefighters on this tough day. Each year on January 26th, Toledo Strong delivers food to area fire stations to honor the two fallen firefighters. Photojournalist Michael Fairchild has that story. Oh, it's, it's a big anniversary. It's the 10th anniversary of um, the arson fire that killed uh, Jamie Dickman and Steve Mashinsky. Um, it's a rough day for our city. It's a rough day for our firefighters. And, uh, you know, we just try to give back where we can. And, and today, delivering donuts and lunches and dinners to all the stations throughout the city, um, you know, it's, it's just, it helps to lift the spirits a little for them. When you see a community support for something like that, and they come in and do that for us, uh, it, it's absolutely wonderful. It's kind of sad that we're doing it in their memory, but what a wonderful thing that the community is doing to, to support us and, and, and help in our memory of Steve and Jamie and Butch now, uh, our dear friend Butch we just lost. We got all kinds of different uh, packaged up sandwiches, macaroni and cheese, some got potato salad. Everybody pitches in and helps us out with this. And then we have individuals who, you know, donate or, uh, you know, will adopt a station and, or their company may adopt a station and, and they take, take donuts. So, you know, it's really just a big community effort. You know, his goal is to get other community support, restaurants, whatnot, private support. And, you know, like I said, he looks to just get dinner and donuts for that day um, as a token of his support and love for the fire department and you know in honor of Steve and Jamie. It does make us feel good knowing that we're you know we're helping them out a little bit and, and the interaction that we get with all the firefighters and at the stations or the departments and it's just all positive interaction so for us that's good. Oh it's, it's great it's a great thing uh, it's not necessary uh, but it's really appreciated especially on you know the anniversary dates of some of the guys that we've lost on the department. It, it's fantastic really and you know what and, and the lunches are pretty good yeah. <laughs> too you know. Took the ham and ham and uh, potato salad and chips. Uh, uh, we talk about where we were that day you know there's probably over half the fire division wasn't even employed by the city of Toledo at that time when you think about how many people retire and, and go uh, on you know um, and so we have to keep those memories alive uh, for our upcoming firefighters and people know that we never want that to happen again. True testament to the community that we have. Toledo Strong is always looking for volunteers. If you're interested in learning more about Toledo Strong, head over to our website where you are right now, WTOL.com.